What's up, Get Lean Journey peeps? Whew, out here getting it in. It's a hot one. It's a hot one. But getting it in, nonetheless. Whew. I got about 30 more minutes of cardio to go. And it'll be a wrap for today. Uh, went to the gym earlier this morning. We worked on uh, deadlift form. Uh, it was a great, great uh, routine and helped me a lot. And my legs are growing already. You know, I've seen a lot of progress in them. Today was weigh-in. Today was a weigh-in and uh, picture day for progress. And uh, everything looked good. Uh, weight, I was two pounds up from my lowest, but... You could see the difference in my back. My back was way more defined and uh, my love handles have gone in some more. So improvement. So since I saw some improvement uh, for my last meal today, I'm not doing a refeed, technically not a refeed. I'm not gonna be eating a bunch of junk for the next three and a half weeks. Uh, my refeed's gonna be a 12 ounce ribeye cooked on the grill and a big sweet potato with a little butter, a little cinnamon on it, and that'll be it. So, uh, that's that. And uh, whew, I have to do an hour of cardio every day, seven days a week. And uh, I didn't really want to do it, but I decided, decided I'd go ahead and get it over with. Um, give y'all an update on my dad. Today, this morning was a blessing to wake up to uh, my stepmom texted me and said my dad actually went to the bathroom on his own this morning so his intestines are trying to function uh, they got a lot of the swelling to go down which opened up the blockage and allowed him to go to the bathroom so thank God for that and he ate something this morning he ate some, some jello and drank a little 7 up so he's doing really well considering way better I talked to him on the phone this morning um, but uh, got up this morning tell you what I've done today got up this morning had seven egg whites one whole egg drank a little uh, pre-workout and went to the gym trained came back went to the little farm I had to hunt and got it ready started getting it ready for deer season baited up um, changed the batteries out in the camera got it back firing and uh got back had my uh my second meal was a protein shake bomar nutrition the um french toast flavor uh protein shake after my workout when i got back from uh going to the farm sorry about that when i got back from going to the farm I had seven ounces of chicken and some Brussels sprouts. Um, when I get back from this walk, I'm going to have seven ounces of chicken and uh, some green beans. And then, like I said, a ribeye, sweet potato for the last meal. Going to relax, maybe work on a couple menus, and uh, watch a little TV and just chill out this evening. Enjoy the evening. But uh, I appreciate everybody keeping my dad in your prayers, me and my family. So... But uh, anyway, that's about all I got. Um, I'm gonna try to start working on some new topics to talk about here soon. Um, it's just been so much on my plate, so much stress lately that I haven't been posting like I usually do. So, but I'm gonna try to get back at it strong here soon. Just ready, ready for some cool fall breezes and sitting outside and enjoying the uh, gift of Mother Nature and what God put us here to do go out and do a little hunting get me some deer meat maybe some hog and uh just enjoy life and uh life's good we all have ups and downs valleys and peaks and uh i've definitely been in a valley lately but uh hey it makes us stronger it makes us realize how blessed we are to have who we have in our life around us and you know it can open your eyes sometimes I know it, hit, it has for me, so. 
but anyway uh hope everyone has a blessed weekend we have one spot left on the menu if anybody's interested in it hit me up and we'll get you a ketogenic meal plan drawn up and you can lose some weight it's never too late to start never too late don't ever think it's too late to start but uh anyway we got a little ways to go but we're gonna get it done get a little sun in and go enjoy the day but i hope everyone has a blessed saturday and good lord willing we'll see y'all tomorrow